Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rechakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And peace and blessings to all you Akimah that pushing his word with all truth and sincerity. And, um, man, I want to go into a real quick lesson, you know, on my lunch break. But, uh, man, I got this Edomite at my job, you know. He always, you know, every time I see him here, uh, you know, every day or every other day, He'll hit me with a little motivational quote, you know what I'm saying? You know, whatnot. And uh, so today, so today he hit me with one, and I got, you know, I got a few uh, notes written down, you know, after after he told me, you know, I went back to my little cubicle and shit, and I was thinking about it, you know? But he hit me with a, uh, he's like, you know, I got one for you today. I was like, what you got for me? He said, day one or one day? You know, I looked at it, I was like, what you mean? He said, day one or one day? So I was like, yeah, you know, go ahead and break it down to me. You know, tell me what you're talking about. So here's like, uh, when somebody say one day, what that mean? They hoping to do something, right? You know, which mean they ain't gonna get to it. One day they gonna get to it, right? And he said, our uh, day one, that's the day you're gonna start something. That's your first day of starting. You getting to it. You ain't, you know what I'm saying? You ain't saying you ain't hoping for it. Say one day, it's like, nah, this day one, I'm starting today. And I was like, you know, yeah. I, I fuck with that. I feel that, you know. But I went to my went to my little cubicle or whatnot, and you know, I just meditate on it. You know, of course, what come to mind, man? The first scripture came to mind was that uh, Sirach five, man. You know, so I'm gonna pull that. But I, I had wrote some notes uh, as well to it. You know, just a few things. You know, to think about. You know, so Lord willingness is edifying to you. I can only got that one precept. You know, whatever the, you know, whatever the Most High Yahweh Hashem Yashalah to come out, but. Uh, it's a few notes, you know, it could be Lord willing is uh, ex exhorting to you, you know, to the Akim, you know, as well as myself But so I wrote I said day one or one day Right and for one day it is wishful thinking right hoping to do something But never put effort forth to make it happen, you know, like people say oh uh, A fat person one day. I want to lose weight, you know, they they, they lip service, but they ain't about action you know, or one day I want to go to Paris. One day I want to... It's one day you hoping to do that, man. But for day one, it's the first day of a plan. Not just wishing to do something, but actually starting the first day with action, man. <laughs> and you know, when I, as I was writing it down, I thought of uh, Elder Ariala, man, out there in Dallas. Because this is the type of things he going to, man. You know, be about action, man. Be about... Getting better, man, as a person, as a man of the law, and as a person, man, you know. And it says, I said, uh, having specific goals and accomplishments, uh, and a way to achieve them, man. So you you have uh, um, things already set that you want to accomplish, man, and you go get it, man, a go getter, so to speak, right? So in in all that, it says, uh, you can continue wishful thinking. That never go. That's Salaki. I said you can continue wishful thinking. That's never going to happen, which is one day, or you can start planning and acting to accomplish what you want, right? And that's day one, man. You know. So I want to pull this first real quick, because of course, soon as I, you know, he told me that I thought about this scripture, man. Uh, you know, as we're supposed to be a man of the law, we got to think of everything and look. Uh, I should say, look at everything spiritual, you know. Apply it to the scriptures, man. Because that's this first and foremost, you know. But I'm going to grab this first. This is uh, Sirach. Uh, five. And seven. It says, Make no tearing to turn to the Lord. And put not off from day to day. Right. Don't just say, One day I'm going to seek out the Lord, man. One day, one day, I'll I see what the Bible talking about. One day, I'll listen to the prophets. Are you scrolling on Instagram or YouTube? One day, I'm going to click on the Hebrew Israelite video and see what they talking about. Don't put off this word from day to day, man. You know? It says, uh, make no tearing to turn to the Lord and put not off from day to day. For suddenly shall the wrath of the Lord come forth. And in thy security... Thou shall be destroyed and perish in the day of vengeance, man. You know? You know, so if you ain't already in this understanding, man, 
as an Israelite, cause hey, the hell with the the uh, heathens, you know they have no part of this uh of this word, man. But for uh, our people, don't put off from seeking the Lord, man. Don't put off from hearing the prophets, man. You know, don't put off from coming back to your uh, heritage, following the laws, statutes, commandments to the best of your ability, man. And that go for us even into this, even in the, in the knowledge, even us in the truth, in the know, so to speak, right? We can't put off from day to day either, man. You know, we might be at home or, uh, 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 and this shit, I'm speaking to myself first. Like, uh, for example, the other day I was like, okay, shit, I'm at work. All right, when I get home, you know, I'm going to the Hebrew, you know, study some Hebrew. Then I read, I want to read this chapter, this chapter. But when I get home, you know, I went into a few Hebrew words and I was like, shit, I would just read. I'll go into that another day, you know? Uh, uh, uh. Uh, I don't have, you know, I said, I'll just read tomorrow. I'm putting off, I was putting off from day to day, man. So this is a cut to myself, you know? And of course, we ain't going to just be in the spirit every day, all day, man, you know? Just pushing every day, all day, videos, reading. Of course, it's balanced to it, but don't put it off, man. But it says, um, because for suddenly shall the wrath of the Lord come forth, and in thou security thou shalt be destroyed and perish in the day of vengeance, man. So you think everything all good. You know, you can think, oh, shit, you know, I'm, I got a job, you know, I'm, I'm feeding my family, we eating, you know, I got somewhere to stay, I got a car to drive, everything good. You know, God blessing me, so to speak, right? So you think you're comfortable in your security, you're going to be destroyed, man, because you put off from the Lord. Instead of saying day one, well, I'm going to do the work, I'm going to read. Day one, I'm going to do the work, I'm going to uh, study the Hebrew, or day one, I'm going to do the work, I'm going to push videos, I'll be brotherly, you know? Charity, you know, you know, so so have a, a, a initiative, so to speak, you know what I'm saying? Have a reason for it, man. Have goals set out and, and go chase them, man. Go do them, man. Put forth action, you know. So I'm going to grab this uh, quick precept. This is Isaiah. Uh, let's see. This is Isaiah 55 and, uh, and 6. It says, Seek ye the Lord while he may be found. It says, Call ye upon him while he is near, man. So it's telling you, Seek the Most High Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai while he may be found, man. You know? Because we're saying there's going to come a time where he ain't found. Right? And how is he found now, man? Through the preaching of his prophets. You know, through the wisdom and knowledge of his prophets going out. And one way is not just the highways and hedges, but on YouTube, on, on the internet, man. You know? And that's happened, uh, what, a few days ago. Uh, YouTube shut down. But it's been going into that, man. So somebody might be on shit YouTube and seeing Israelite videos, never uh, clicked on them. You know, never uh, really wanted to go into them and learn. But when all hell break loose, when the most high ain't gonna be found, when YouTube and the internet is taken away, then they go seek the most high. <laughs> then it's too late, man. Cause you kept saying, one day, one day I'll watch it. One day I'll do it. No, man, day one. Like the uh <laughs> man, what's that commercial? Uh damn, oh, we used to come on TV, uh uh Everest, Everest College, you know, the little dude, uh, you know, the Jake, he always come on out like, man, yeah, I see you, you on your sofa. You know, you wasting time. Get up. Go do something. Get up. You know? I'm yeah, I, I think it's Everest College. You know, brothers go look at it, but uh had a had a little hat set aside and shit. Like, get up. You know, go be active. Go do something. Start today. Today is the day. You're sitting on the couch, you're watching TV, and your life is passing you by. You keep procrastinating over and over. Well, maybe I'll go to school next year, or maybe next semester. No, do it right now. They'll work with you after work, or you can go before work. You can do whatever you need to do to graduate. Go talk to somebody right now. They out to help you. You spend all day on the phone anyhow. Why don't you make a phone call that's going to help you in your future? All you got to do is pick up the phone and make the call. Why are you making it complicated? It's easy. Go do something. Start today. Today is the day. Yeah, today is the day, man. Day one. Day one. And day one gonna go to day two. You're doing it. Day two gonna go to day three, man. Day three gonna go to day four. And Lord willing, we endure to the end. You know, so that we can be saved and not put off from day to day, man. 
Because it's going to come to time where the Most High Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rechak and his prophets ain't going to be found, man. You know? Let me grab this real quick. This is uh, Psalms 32. And I'll start at uh, 5. It says, I acknowledge my sin unto thee, and my iniquity have I not hid. I have I said, I will confess my transgressions unto the Lord, and thou forgavest the iniquity of my sin. Right. So when you turn to the Lord, man, Yahweh, why Yahweh shy? Repent, man. Realize your transgressions. You know, realize your wrongs. And even us into this truth, we still doing that to this day, man, repenting. You know, it ain't just repent one time, you good, man. You know, constantly repent for things and not just repent and say, oh, I repent, forgive me for this in the name of Yahweh Shai. And keep doing it, man. You got to change those things, man. You know, repent and then turn to the ways of the Lord, man. Have faith in Yahweh Shai, first and foremost. You know, uh, uh, believe in the word. And uh, 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 turn to the law, statutes, commandments to the best of our abilities, man. And it says, for this shall everyone that is godly pray unto thee in a time when thou mayest be found, man. When he may be found. Because the scripture just said in Isaiah, seek ye the Lord while he may be found, man. And if you look around this world now, bro, it's coming down. We in the end, bro. Hey, we in the end. We in the last second of the last days, you know. So the Most High giving his information out now, man. It's accessible every day, all day. In different languages, uh, uh, 24 7. 24 7, 365, man. His word is access accessible, man. You know, you keep putting off in your security. Then, when that day come of great destruction, you're going to be destroyed, man. And Lord willing, we not of that number. Lord willing, we day ones, you know, day one, day two, you know, day three, man. And it ain't just as far as the word, man. It's, um, in our daily life as well, man. Going back to uh, Elder Ariala, how I always say, you can't just be a bum in this truth, man. Turning to your how about Shemiel Shai, this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, man, should make you want to be a better man, a better person. Make you want to get your life together, man. You know? Say if uh, a brother might not have a job, you know what I'm saying? Oh, shit, one day I'm going to fill out an application, you know? Never do it. You know? Never do it, always putting it off, man. Hey, one uh, uh, day one, man, go do that. You know? Man, matter of fact, uh, I'll grab this and I'll go ahead and end it real quick. This is, um, this is, uh, Ecclesiastes 9 and 10. And this is one of my, you know, favorite scriptures, man. You know, always, always get me going, you know, when I'm in my soul, so to speak, a funk, you know what I'm saying? But it says, Whatsoever thy hand findeth to do, do it with thy might. Right? So whatever you do in this world, man, go hard. You know, of course, first and foremost, Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shai, and the work that they commanded us to do, we got to go hard, man. You know? We got to study, man. We got to pray constantly. You know? We got to beat out for brothers, man. You know? Uh, uh, doing the work, reading, studying, all that, man. It says, whatsoever thy hand find to do, do it with thy might. For there is no work, nor device, nor knowledge, nor wisdom in the grave, whether thou goest. Right. So do it now while we got the time, man. While you have a chance to say, I'm going to start today. Today is day one, man. You know? Because we, we don't know when our time up on this earth. We don't know when the Most High going to take our spirit, man. Because it said there's no... No work, nor knowledge, nor wisdom in the grave. Whether thou goest, man. So start now. And you know, I just, bro, you know, the, hey, uh, Edom might have my job. You know, he hit me with that quote, man. You know, this what came to mind. So we got to be better men of Yahweh, better men of the Lord. And waste no time starting now, man. And even with ourselves, how we carry ourselves, man. Uh, amongst these people without. You know, amongst the Gentiles and the Israelite foreigners, man. Who have no knowledge, you know, carry ourselves uh, accordingly, man. As men of the Lord, you know. Paying our bills, you know. 
the simple things like that, man. Being men, you know. So, man, I just, you know, I just want to go into that, man. Uh, Lord willing, it was, you know, encouraging to brothers, you know. And uh, Lord willing, it was edified. So, hey, man, one day or day one, you know. So, hey, uh, uh, I want to give all praises and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Bahashim, Rechak Wadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of great millstone and peace and blessings. So, are you Akimak that pushing his word with our truth and sincerity? And with that, Shalom.